Unless you want me to do it. Okay. No, I've recorded it. It's fine. Um, so, plan then. Do you want to take, I mean, who wants to lead this meeting? I think, I think Karina. <laughs> okay, <laughs> I thought you might say that. <laughs> um, so basically, everybody's passes should be ready to collect at the door of Hampton Court. If you haven't um, received it yet already, you should have had the link for the email. I think pretty much everybody's signed up. I think we're all signed up now. I'm not sure about you, Nathan. <laughs> um, but, um, I, have, I haven't. <laughs> <laughs> Tim's not yet, but yes, that's obviously a pending. It's I guess. literally on the exactly. next thing on my to-do list every single day. Like, <laughs> do the pass. <laughs> Sorry. I'll start cracking the whip. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> yeah, so but if you Daniel, can do that, Daniel, you can Daniel do that hasn't, today. Daniel hasn't either, because I just sent him the link. Oh, okay, right, right. Um, I've... I've, I've sent it him I've sent him an updated link as well which would go directly to his email oh perfect so he can he would he should use that one really I'll double, okay. I'll double check that with him and tell him yeah, yeah, that's that. great. Has, yeah. Char has Charlene the babysitter done no she she hasn't yet but I've just only got her pass allocated today literally an hour ago they said it's up there so I can now do it now um yeah, but yeah we've definitely got her in on the Monday now brilliant um, from midday yeah. Just from midday. Yeah, from midday, yeah, because unfortunately they say no children before midday. But to be honest, the morning on the Monday, I'm understanding it's going to be quite quiet. It's going to be loads of people still making sure their, you know, displays are perfect for <laughs> photographing and stuff like that. Um, but yeah, basically it's going to be mostly press people milling around on the Monday. So that's kind of, they will be doing probably filming and things like that. Um, the BBC have coverage over at least four days, I think, out of the seven. <laughs> Um, oh, so sure. Bowie here, sorry. <laughs> no, you're fine. Bowie, Bowie's Hi, just Bowie. joining in. So Hi. what are, Karina, what are the timings for each day? So we have to be there um, around 9.30. It opens at 10 to the public. Um, so obviously from Tuesday. Monday? Pardon? What about on the Monday? So the Monday, um, I'm not sure about the public actually, but they still no. say to be there by half nine. Okay. Oh, wow. Yeah. So is it 9.30? I'm going to check on that as well. Every it's day, 9.30? Nine, yes, 9.30. And Monday is a bit different because it finishes really late. Yeah. So what time is Monday ending? Technically, they say 11.30 at night. Oh, but yeah. the, the public are allowed to mill around until 10. So that's why they give you an extra hour or so to sort of tidy up and everything for the next day. That's going to um, be Monday. Yeah, it's going to be interesting. <laughs> And then the other days, what time does it end? So the other days, it's 7.30. 7.30. So, so Tuesday to Sunday is 7.30 finished. To be honest, if anyone wants to go a bit earlier, I mean, that's up to them really, um, but I will be there until the end. I have to make sure that the stall is sort of secure and everything and any stock I'll be taking away with me. Okay. Um, so yeah, I mean, from you can get there for nine o'clock. It might be worth getting there at nine o'clock because of the traffic is going to be a bit nuts. Can we park um, around there? Or? So there are there is parking I can get you, which is half the day, but we're only about fifteen minutes walk from Hampton Court, so it's probably better to park where we are. Me and Lena are on Station Road, oh, and then just walk down. I think that's better than paying ten pounds. Yeah, oh, or Emily's, yeah. Park at your guys. Get the bus, because there's a bus that goes, it takes about five minutes. Yeah, yeah. that's right. Yeah. Okay, great. All right, then. Or my Robin. Hi, guys. Sorry, I'm at work on GP land. <laughs> hey, Robin. <laughs> I love that. Come join my examining table. Oh, with no. With <laughs> on it. Wow. That's hilarious. <laughs> That's so scary. Catch a grain. Right. Um, so I think everybody needs to be reminded to bring water. <laughs> they do have food and they do have water and like things to buy stuff and music. It should be quite fun. Um, but <laughs> you've gone quiet, Karina. Move to your microphone. Oh, sorry. <laughs> My phone is doing that. Um, my phone is buzzing as well. Can you hear me now? Yeah. Yeah, I was just saying that we need to bring water. Each person can buy food to eat and things like that, snacks on, at, on site, but you know, they're not particularly cheap. So um, <clears throat> just definitely bring a drink of water because it's going to be such a long day. 
And do you have space on the stand to put personable, personal valuables? Um, so basically I've got like a part of the display that I've um, kind of designed. I will be putting, um, there's a couple of secure cabinets and behind them I will have, um, it's, it's nothing that's properly secure really, to be honest, if you can, um, if you can keep your phones on you or wallets on you, I don't know. Um, I, we can hide bags behind the behind this display, but obviously we need to keep a mind and keep an eye out on watching that. And have we got a place that we can um, put the stock that we're not using? Um, we can put it in my house. In my in my in my house, I've got space. What um, I mean, what I mean is, is that actually so, on the day. Yeah, because are oh, you wanting to have all the stock that we have on display? Um, most of it, I do want some stock. Basically, the crates I've got, they're like apple crates. So they're going to be stacked up and I will be able to move them out and put the stock behind it where people can't get to it. Okay. Cool. All right then. So, on that note, should we just... Um, we've, we've got nine... Sorry, I'm taking over. Go on, Karina. No, no, go, go please. <laughs> okay. Um, so we... We've got to be there from 9 a.m. till 7.30 or 9.30 at latest yeah. every day, Monday to Sunday. Are you getting up there on the Sunday to set up? Do you need help? How's yeah. that going? I'm, I'm doing I'm that with Lena. On the Sunday before, Moira. <laughs> oh, no. Sorry. No, on that yeah. Sunday. You Sunday, can help sorry. me on closing down, Moira, if you're up for yeah, it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Absolutely. <laughs> I'll, just, I'll book myself great. out for the day and tell Gareth I won't be back. It's fine because he'll be at home with the kids That's anyway. That's lovely. So closing down is 5.30 on the Sunday. So the Sunday's a slightly shorter day oh, okay. in that sense, really. So um, Lena is, uh, her husband is helping me set up the, the display and everything on the Sunday before. So it should all be done by Monday. And what time? Uh, is the latest that uh, you you can set up on the Sunday, or we can get there? Uh, for you? Yeah, because I've got the stock. Oh right, see, I see. Sorry, yes. Um, so it's all day Sunday until I think that is seven thirty as well. Okay, so I need to get there for like, yeah, because I uh, I want to get there as late as possible. Yeah. Can I bring the stock on the Monday morning, or do you need it there Sunday night? Um, Sunday night would be better to be honest, but you can bring it on the Monday morning. Okay, I'll try and bring it Sunday night for like 6 30, 7 o'clock. Okay, mm. yeah, that'd be and good. then because it's not going to take, we just need to put it on the stand, don't we? Yeah, it's, it's, basically just, it's just basically putting it behind the display rather yeah, exactly. than I will have, I will hopefully have the display sort of up and set, set up really mainly. Okay, cool. All right, then. Um, it just means that if I have to leave at like six, it means I have to leave my house at like half five and I won't be able to do Sunday dinner really with the kids and I'd like to do that. Yeah. So we'll see, we'll see. Okay. Just, um, just bring it Monday morning then, Nathan. It's not really a... Will I be able issues. to, will I be able to drive up and give you two cardboard boxes? Um... I would probably, it'd probably be better if I met you outside to the show. Are we going to be able uh, to carry, are we, are we going to be able to carry those two cardboard boxes in? Yes. What about, Nathan, if you're going to send uh, this week, at the end of the week, Karina's house? Sorry, oh, Lena, I, could, I couldn't catch it. Oh, I could get half of them sent Sorry, to Karina's yeah, house. Yeah, yeah. because yeah, I have half the stock here already. Oh, right, yeah. Um, but I'm getting it topped up. So I already got the stock, but I've used it for other shows. Yep. So, We've got some stock as well. We've got a lot of intro kits. Okay. Okay, so let's just, let's just, let's just figure this out first. How many intro kits do we need, do you think? A hundred? Yeah, more. M more, you reckon, Tim? Um, 150? I think just get a hundred for now. We can always order more at the beginning of the week if we think we need more. That's true. Let's do that. Nice. I just um, got a message from Debs. Sorry, Debs has just sent me a message saying she couldn't get on the Zoom. She might have been. Um, family essential kits. Thirty. 
what I've got down that we need. Yeah, okay. How um, many of those have you got? 15, 20. Well, we, we need to order some stock, Nathan, for the end of the month. Okay. Do you want us to order some more? Do you want us to order the rest? Um, I don't know. It's tricky because we need to work out how we're actually going to... Who's, whose stock is whose? Yeah. Well, not just that. If you buy it separately, you're going to want the cash and it can't be inputted into doTERRA. Right. So we need to work out exactly what we're doing. Otherwise, we're just going to... I say we just do it one way. Okay. And we do it sale and return. So basically... You've got to type in do not ship. Yeah. Is what I think. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. <clears throat> so I don't think it's wise for you to buy position kits or home essential kits like that. Okay. Well, then you'll just you'll get reimbursed yourself for all of it at a later date. Well, I'm not paying for it. Okay. It's on, they you only give us. us. They only give our team or us. We're the only ones allowed to do sale and return. Um, so they'll give us what we ask for in stock and then we ship back to them what we don't use. Okay. So we don't pay for it. Okay. Which is why you need to sign them up, like you're signing them up a normal person and put do not ship because yeah. then it says do not ship. Sally takes that, they give it to Sally, it goes into her office, she marks off one of Nathan's stock accounted for. Right, okay. Because it's not sent to them. Does that make sense? Yeah, because you're giving it to them directly, so therefore they don't get sent it, but therefore yeah. it marks off that you want it's one of your stock, and then they send you another one, do they? No, nope, they don't send me another one, they just mark it off the stock that I've already given, so that just takes that one off the shelf, as in it was sent to them, but Nathan doesn't have that anymore, basically. Yeah, so I think we've been joined by oh. Nadia and Daniel. No, no. Oh, oh that's, brilliant. That's so, do we need to recap anything? Right. Yeah. yeah, sorry, that's what I didn't understand, okay. Um, so, yeah, we, we need to recap as, as well. Are we going to have the <laughs> iPads there? Yes. Okay, yeah, we've so got Wi-Fi connection, that's all sorted. Um, uh, Lena, you're on mute, I can't hear you. I think Lena's trying so to say something. What about uh, hum, uh, home essential kit? That you want yeah, to let's, have let's, talk, yeah. let's talk about the kits first, yeah. So... Family essential kits, if I bring 30. Yeah. Home essential kits, 10. I don't yep. know if we sell tons of them. Yeah, yeah, so you've got 10 with the Immortel offer. So there's 10 home essential kits. If we start selling more, we can always order more. If it continues, that is the Immortel offer. It will. Yeah. It will. <laughs> I, know. <laughs> I like that, Tim. You were straight in there. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, okay, so it is going to continue. Nathan's told everyone there. Go, so. <laughs> but well, that is a good point, though. Are we going to have the Immortel bottles as well, or how does, will that work then? They'll get sent that, will they? Um, I'll ask Sally to send me the Immortel as well. Okay. okay. So you can, you can give it to them on the day. Lovely, that's great. Yeah, yeah what, it's an amazing but incentive. What, but what it means is that all of you guys have to follow the procedure exactly. Okay, do you want to... Yes. So through the, do you want to tell us what that is now or? Yes. Want... Yes. Yeah. So. Yeah. Payment procedure is a good one. <laughs> okay. But first of all, so are we having any summer summer trio kits? No. I've I'd got say, ten of those. Yeah. I, I mean, I would say, I would say that's great. Oh, that's working fine. But, but I would also say probably not as well, because the summer citrus oils are rare. There's not loads of them. And um, they're not signing up to anything. You're just giving them samples yeah. of stuff that you probably want. I think really it's just good to have for the preview evening, Nathan. I think people, yeah. for what I've, what I've heard from the organisers is that the preview evening on that Monday is the main place where people just like to spend their money um, in, in that sense. So I think the Summer Trio kit is like a lovely gift set that you can offer someone, basically. So I would just bring your 10. I think okay. that's all, all we need for that. Okay, so the two, here's the. So, do we have classes set up for afterwards? Um, okay, I don't, okay, I get you. 
We've got classes running every Mommy, every Thursday. Okay, so we need a list of those classes that yeah. we can and classes, yeah. Just like normal that we can book people on to. Just like yeah, we normally could, do. Could you email me? Could everybody email me their list of classes and I can just compile a list? Because I think Moira's got separate ones already done. I've got some Lena's got I, Lithuanian could, ones. I wouldn't do that. No? No. You don't think I can compile a list? I wouldn't do that. Okay. I would I would specifically come up with a list of five or six classes okay. that you and Ems or the people are going you're all going to be at because you want to make these professional classes. Right, yeah. okay. They can't just be classes in people's houses. Okay. We could yeah. do it at the Reformed Church, couldn't we, with Emily? Because if she's doing one every um, Thursday, then that would be a great place because we can always just join in, can't we? Yeah. Well, we've, we've we, Emily's one is in Teddington, isn't it? Yeah. Oh, is it? Yeah. But we yeah, could, she's but changed. Right, we could. It's with Robin as well. So we just, I need to just, um, I've got some classes down. So let, we just need to liaise on that basically because let me look at the calendar. I need to mix the times as well. So we, Thursday nights is taken care of. So maybe some other days and stuff. So it's okay, not always no, so I've put a class in for Tuesday the 11th, um, which is straight after at the church in Hampton Hill. So that's a class that week. Is um, that the United Reformed Church, that's Kate? Reformed Church, yeah. Reform. Yeah. Reform. Then reform. 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 <laughs> reform. Reform. Oh, yeah, reform. <laughs> I can't do the rest of that week because we've got Lorna's first classes. But then the following week, um, I put a, I put a webinar down for anybody that can't make the live classes. Um, how many classes, Nathan, would you suggest, and how long and how long a period would you suggest we need to do for a fair like this? A five month, or six, five or six in the first month or two. Right. Okay. So going spanning over about about five or six weeks, yeah. and maybe, and maybe what, one a week, one or two a week. One or two a week. Yeah. And um, I would just we've got, we've got Thursday the twentieth that Robin and I are doing, so that's one that people could. And the twenty eighth. And the twenty eighth. And, okay, yeah, I'm not there on the 28th, but you're... But I will be. Yeah. And is there, is there, what you want to also make sure is that on each of these classes, is there a maximum amount of people that can come on to it? Yes. Well, yeah. Yeah. So you want to also put on that sheet a limit because yeah. you don't want to be having 50 people come into one class. Okay. Mm -hmm. You've only got 20 people, uh, room for 20 on. Yeah. yeah, we've not done it in that room before, but we're doing it this week, so we'll get a better idea, won't we? No, no, no. Yeah. So um, if you guys, if you guys, you might need to do this offline because this is going to take a little bit of work. Yeah. Okay. yeah. But if you guys come up with the five or six classes over that month, and then when people book them on, ideally, you would then, the people that have booked them on would go to those classes as well. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. If you can't make those classes, then you need to just tell the upline or get somebody to look after those people otherwise what we see is you'll lose those people and the whole point of you going to this show is to catch those people that go to those classes yeah can i so, Karina? can you do a whatsapp group for us all for yes yeah we will do okay yeah. so we can just liaise on that after where in teddington are you doing your classes emily the uh, St. mary's parish hall on langham road bottom of the high street that's, that's where I live. <laughs> oh, perfect. Yeah. Just, we'll move on, but just about the classes, they're all in the same location. They're all obviously Hampton Hill, Teddington. Is there any value in having a class? I mean, does everyone that come to the flower show from this area or do people come from all over London? I've got friends yeah. coming. So is there any value in having a class somewhere else? I think online classes are going to be key because at Hampton Court Palace, it's completely international visitors. Okay. Um, they're not just local. I mean, most people will be RHS members, but that's all across the country. Yeah. Um, so generally, I'd say are, mainly um, Surrey. Oh, oh, yeah. Right. We need to liaise on um, on those that's because I can't fit much more in my diary than what I've got already, and then we yeah. go away on the twenty third. So I might need some of you guys to kind of step up and. Um, yeah. Agree to post. You're moving as well, aren't you, Karina? I am moving house. Yeah, in the middle of <laughs> all of that. But no, I, I should be in Hampton for July. Um, yeah. Let's we'll try and get them all done in July. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. yeah. I would say do do four or five classes, live classes, and get two or three webinars yeah. in. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Brilliant. Okay. Um, and I wouldn't bother. Just do them all in Hampton Hill. Don't bother doing anywhere else. Okay. 
Let's do one in Hampton Hill and do three webinars. Okay. Okay. You sure not not Teddington as well? Yeah, We're friendly. Teddington's well, yeah, fine. That's fine. Yeah, because oh, that's just down the road, just down I the road from Hampton Hill. I, I meant, I meant that. I meant that. Anyway, don't, cool. don't enjoy doing one anywhere else, okay? Yeah. So what I, I did want to talk about taking payments because obviously if we're all there on different days, um, some people are going to find taking payments a bit more complicated. But I will have my computer there, so basically that will be plugged in and accessible every day. Um, Lena, you're bringing your tablet as well, aren't you? Your iPad. So, so we should have two devices at least. In terms of taking payment, yeah, you, there's two. There's going to be two ways that you're going to need to take the payment, or three okay. ways. So, yep. if, so what you're looking to do is you're looking to, first of all, you're looking to get <laughs> contacts of people on mm -hmm. the iPads. Yeah. Okay. Mm -hmm. So is everyone going to bring their own iPad? Yeah. yeah. I don't have. I still don't have one. Okay, I don't have cool. an iPad, but I have my It computer. works on your phone, Robin, that app. Okay. It works on your phone. Yeah. So if everyone has their own way, and then if you need to, you can borrow other people's on the days, but yeah. we don't want people turning up and three people didn't bring an yeah. iPad. And then you've only yeah, got yeah. one iPad there. Because that'll be annoying for you. Um, so if you can all bring iPads, um, I'll send Karina the software link. And if you can all down the <laughs> download the software and put it as Great. like an app on your phone. Yep. And I'll create a special one, a special thing just for Hampton Court. Do we need um, to re-download that, Nathan, then, if you're doing a special one? Yeah, you probably need to re-download it, otherwise you'll just have my link. Okay. Okay. Um, delete, you can delete my other one or call it Nathan's and then put the Hampton Court one on the other one. I'll delete um, it, then. So you understand it. Um, so you're looking to get, number one thing, people's contact details. Number two, booking them onto a class. So you can book them onto a class and assume we're going to be selling them for £10. Are we doing that, Karina? Yep. Okay, so you book them on for £10 and I would have some wild oranges there like we do. And if they book an online one, they get the webinar right, they get the wild orange right there and then. Okay. And the live class, they get a wild orange when they come to the class. Yeah. So obviously don't sell it to them, the webinar. You don't want to be selling the webinars, you want to be selling the live classes, and if yeah. else fails, you do a webinar. And yeah. then you just give them the wild orange. Okay. You don't sell the wild orange to them with that, because otherwise people will always yeah. go for the webinar. And price-wise for the webinar, is it a bit, is it ten, five pounds or? I would say not five pounds, because this is, a, this is going to be a wealthy clientele. 10 pounds is not going to make any difference. If you do five pounds for webinar and ten pounds for live class, what are people going to choose? Yeah, yeah. Okay, I think so too. Yeah, I, think um, that's I would just call it ten pounds for both. I don't okay. think it will make any difference. Uh, what happens with the money? Okay, so I think if it's cash, so sorry, we'll talk about that in a second. Okay. Um, so, so you're looking to sell the kits for ten pounds, so a class for ten pounds. Yeah. Then you've got the intro kits which I would suggest we sell them for 25 pounds. Yeah, yeah. And they get a class for free, webinar or I think same thing. If they get a webinar, they get the wild orange there. Yeah. They come to the class, they get webinar orange there. The yeah. But you're taking cash for the classes or for the intro kits, okay? Or you're taking an IZF payment on a card. Have you got? Oh, are you, you, are you, right taking, are you what on a card? Sorry, Nathan. So I've got an Izettle, but the problem is I need my Izettle for the Love Natural, Love Organic. Oh, okay. Right. So you can have it for the first four days, but I would recommend that we get another one. On okay. So can we get one in the space in that space of time, Nate? I'm, I'm, we're happy to get one of those. Exactly. I've seen another one, quite good as well. Do it what today. What was it even called? Sorry, I just, I just, so there are yeah. different ones, aren't there? There's different ones. It doesn't really matter what one you get. Okay. It just needs to be one that connects to your phone so that it uses your phone signal rather than Wi Fi. Okay. Yeah, no, I've seen a really nice one and it's not that expensive. Somebody was showing it me the other day. Um, get well, get that. It, it needs to come before the next two days. You need to check that how much money you can put through it without signing up as a business, because sometimes it takes a week or two to sign up as a business to get unlimited amount of money on it. 
the okay. Izetto, you can sign up for a personal one and you can get 4,000 for the year without doing anything straight away. How much does the Izetto cost? I think it's like 60 quid and then it's like three or two and a half percent. Okay. So that's what you take. You take the Izetto and it's really easy to use. We can show you, you know, show you one of the you take Izetto or you do cash. So three and if you could do, get a cash box together, and we would have a float. We'd probably need a float in there of like a hundred quid of fivers and tenors. Um, and okay. then, uh, and so it's literally just classes and just um, intro kits that you'll be selling via the Izetto and via cash. Okay. Then if you sell a family essential kit or a home essential kit, you will need to go through Karina or Lena. And um, Karina or Lena will then sign it up and do it because they must put in there, do not ship. Otherwise, it will ship. They'll, if you do that, my stock will go be rapidly depleted and we won't have paid for it. <laughs> yeah. So you have to promise me that you'll do do not ship. <laughs> so you just mean you're going to use their computers to sign someone up there and then? Well, yeah, or it'd be great if they spoke to Karina and Lena because Karina and Lena are going to be there. They're the ones Every that are going to be there all the time, right? Yeah. So they'll put it well, everything. People can enroll there and then and they yes. can take a kit home with them. Yes. yes. That's exactly that's, what they're doing. That's the main thing that I think we really want them to do. <laughs> and whoever's exactly. done the contact gets the enrollment, but we yeah. do it through you two, yeah. Yeah, so Karina and Lena are just making sure that the stock is right and that you're doing it right. Okay. And then they're going to write down... I haven't asked them to do this. But if, they can, <laughs> if they can write down on a piece of paper, everybody that sells a kit and the person's name. So that I've got, you know, I've got a list at the end of it that I can tally up with Sally as to exactly, and I'd like to do that at the end of every day so that if somebody does get missed, I can call Sally in the morning and catch them <laughs> yeah. before it gets sent out. Does that make sense? Yeah. So this is going to take a big group effort. It's going to take a lot of admin, but it, it will save us loads of hassle and time if everyone can follow the procedures. Yeah. Yeah, and I think we're just we're going to be writing down if people sell intro kits as well, aren't we? Yes. Yes. Yeah, so, I think if we can all keep track of who we've done ourselves anyway, it might be good mm -hmm. to have your own list of people's name. Um, just on your phone or something. Well, I think... I, People won't do that. We we talked no? about it in the past. People just oh, okay. You won't have time. Okay. So when you're doing the when you're doing the sign up form, in the comments put intro kit. Yeah. Sold, okay. Sold an intro kit. It doesn't really matter whether you remember to do the intro kit or not. At the end of the day, we're going to tally up how many intro kits were sold, and how many we've got left. And then at the end of all of it, we can just say, our oh, M's, all of yours went, here's the money for yours. Nay, if you've still got all of yours, here's all yours back. Yeah. And or then obviously we use the takings as well to cover the cost of the venues for classes and things as well. So the takings for the classes and for the intro kits. So once the kits have been paid for, that have been sold, there should be about £10 left on every one of them. That, that will then go towards the class venues first and the wild oranges. Okay. Then if there's any money left over, it will be split between the people that paid the money, depending on what they paid. That's usually what we do. Is that okay with you, Karina? Yeah, I think that's fine. That's what we agreed, wasn't it? Yeah. yeah. Yes. Okay. Um, uh, so really, it's going to be great. It's just a, it's just a case of when you take payments and when you sell kits that you do the right thing. Really, that that's really the complicated part. You just got to make sure you do the right stuff there because I'm not there most of the days, um, but Karina and Lena are. Karina's great at this kind of thing. You're, you're sorted. <laughs> <laughs> you are. You're you're really, Sorry, really good. Panic, but no, I know I'm fine. You'll no. be fine. <laughs> You'll be cracking the whip. Yeah. And then, over, 
I would suggest I've got this the, far. I'm not giving up now. <laughs> I would suggest at the end of every day we have a stock count and a money count. Sorry, darling. I'm just on the phone. I'll be off in a couple of minutes. Um, so we have a Can stock. Is there anything in particular, like colours wise, to blend in with doTERRA or the stand or just whatever? Can we take that up in a second, Cathy? Oh, yeah. <laughs> sorry. I just wanted to just finish the last point on the sorry, money side of things. <laughs> no, sorry. Sorry, um, No, no, you're fine, man. Because. <laughs> um, Oh, the God. money, the money side of things, we need to add up at the end of every, at the end of every day. So there's no money lost. And Karina, if you're or Lena, if you, you need to take the cash tin home with you, yeah, yeah, every day. And then also add up all the stock and make sure it adds up against the name. So for instance, the position kits and family home essential kits, we need to make sure that what you count matches what was sold that day. And if it doesn't, we then need to just figure it out. And then we just need to make sure. So if you send me the names, I will then send those names to Sally to double check they don't go out as a double check. All right. So sorry, Kathy. Over to you. What were you saying? <laughs> really irrelevant. I was just saying, do we need to wear anything in particular? It's not relevant. <laughs> <laughs> really relevant. Maybe nothing too bright. <laughs> Maybe Thank you. Clown outfit. Make it very natural. Okay. <laughs> so that's next weekend, Emily. <laughs> <laughs> so, what would we, uh, Karina, what would we, we ideally wear? Um, I don't think. I think just smart casual. Up, do you? I mean, most people are going to be just fairly, <laughs> fairly standard. But Shall yeah, wear maybe... black. How about black? I'm we, suggesting... can't, we can all wear black, but we might look like waiters. <laughs> no. oh, we bought an oil t-shirt for Tim. He said, "Yeah, oil wow. t-shirts are good, right? I think they're fine." He's got a DoTerra t-shirt. I've got actually, I've got a DoTerra. I've got an oil top, and I've got an apron that somebody I can leave that people can wear, which has got lavender on it, which is quite. I've worn that one. It's lovely. Yeah, uh, and I've got a little doTERRA waistband that I can leave as well that Nathan will look lovely in. Ah! <laughs> uh, headband? Yeah. yeah. Um, let me just introduce you to Daniel. Daniel's going to be there on Thursday, Friday. Daniel, can you hear? No. Where is he? I don't know if he's listening. I can't hear. I know he's got hi, other Daniel. people there. <laughs> you want to introduce we're all, yourself? We're all saying hi. Hi. <laughs> You want to introduce yourself to the team, Daniel? Yeah, mate. I think he's he might muted be at the moment. Take, I think he's trying to take him safe off mute. <laughs> <laughs> I, can't hear him. I have um, to go in a sec, by the way, guys. No, it's fine. Let's I'll try. do as well. Was there, anything, was there anything else, Karina? No, I think that's the main The main thing I wanted to cover was the, the payments and the money, really. Um, I did want to mention incentives, if we're doing any incentives. I think everybody can decide... Um, Lena and I have got some A to, A to Z guides. If people sign up on the page, we we're, we're, we're going to give them an A to Z guide, um, or and our dilutions chart perhaps, just to make sure they've got like safety. Um, I think I think with things like that, you, I think people can do that themselves. Yeah. But just make it so that it doesn't. It's not obvious to yeah. other people uh, around. So you just like you could say, look, I'll give you. I'll give you this if you do this kind of like I don't know in a way that it's not obvious to everyone because everyone won't be off in the same incentive. No, that's true. That? All right. I was going to say as well with the um, home essential kit. Sorry, Barry's having a meltdown. No, um, fine. It always cuts through my brain. I'm like, oh, I'm just trying to say. Um, yeah, with the home essential kits, you get a diffuser in them, don't you? Yeah. Uh, are they do they come in a box or do, oh, are you making those boxes up? I couldn't remember what you said. Do they already come as a package? Uh, we were going to get some boxes, weren't we? I think I we have were the boxes. You have the boxes. So I have, yeah. So we'll put them in wooden boxes. Okay. And then we'll charge. I reckon we charge two hundred and fifty pounds for the home essential kit. Okay, with, great. With a box, and with actually, no, we can't do that. It has to be okay. It will have to because we're putting it through the system. Can't charge anymore. Right. So it will have to be cost price. So you will have to put in there the box. You will have to put in there the home essential kit, and the diffuser comes with it. 
So. Okay, cool. But the, uh, I'll bring the diffusers. I've got the diffusers. <laughs> so they'll come too. Uh, I, I can get some brown paper bags, which are quite large. Would they fit into a paper bag? Like, um, obviously yeah. a bag with handles. <laughs> yeah, they would. Yeah, that'd be great. Yeah, that'd be that'd perfect. Be, yeah, people. I think that's probably worth doing, isn't it? If I just get people some large always, bags. People always <laughs> want to take a bag. They're quite heavy. Can yeah. we have a, 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 some sort of laminated sign as well that has the details of how, how much things are and the, their costs? Mm, that's a good yeah, idea. I was actually blackboard. <laughs> blackboard. Yeah. yeah. Blackboard's nice. Blackboard's great. Yeah, because we can, yeah, we can yeah. do a few. Bye, Moira. I think Moira's got to go. Bye. Thanks, Moira. Bye. Daniel's on now. Hey, do you want to, hey, Daniel, <laughs> say hi to the team? Hi, Daniel. Hi, everyone. Hi, hi, Daniel. Daniel. hi Hey, guys. <laughs> I was watching you. I was still, I'm being a bit of a stalker. It's great stuff so far. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I'm very excited about this because my mum lives uh, 10 minutes from Hampton Court, so Lovely. I can visit her as well. Oh, so. really? Oh, that's I'm delighted. Nice. Well done. You can come and visit us more often then. Definitely. Definitely. <laughs> is your mum coming to Hampton Court, Daniel? Yeah, she, she, she was funny. She said, oh, all the rich people come on Monday and she, on the first couple of days, so it made they me do. laugh when you said it. Um... So, just quickly, yeah. how many intro kits do people bring in and family essential kits and home essential kits, just so that I know what I've got to bring? We've got about 40 intro kits, but we can get more if need be. Okay. So, I've got six at the moment, but I was going to order more. <laughs> Mommy's here. And wild oranges. Tim, do you and Tim want to get 200 wild oranges? Yep, handy. Yep. Right if you guys get... They're not very good PV, by the way. But. Oh, no, we don't know, no. no. <laughs> That's why you have it over. Thanks, Thanks David. <laughs> no, but, but, you'll get your, but you should get your money back for them. Yeah. Because that, that'll be in class, included in the class tickets and stuff, so you can make that for them. So if you guys get 200 wild oranges... Um, Karina, how many intro kits are you going to bring? I've only got six at the moment, but I was going to bring... Uh, Another six, yeah, 12. It's gonna bring 12. Okay, so if, if you bring 12, um, Emily and Tim, how many do you want to bring? Well, we've got 40, but do you want us to get more? I think you can probably just bring 40 and then we can order more, like premier delivery, like stand like, a fast delivery if we need it. I need to get 50 for the love organic, so on my own. Um, so I could get, I could bring. If you bring four, I reckon if you guys bring maybe 60 and I'll bring like 20 or 30. Okay, so we need to order about 20 more. Yeah. Should we, just, should we, if we just get all the intro kits and have it on one person? So we don't have to worry about stock. That would make sense. Why don't just we get, just get, if you're, let's we just get them all and then. You, yeah, and that makes sense. You guys, you guys get 100. That's good. That's good. Have that's you good. got emotions kits, Nathan? I was. I think we said before to bring oh, yeah. some emotion kits, but they've got the touch ones now as well, haven't they? I say we stick with one or the other. Okay. I've got I've got the emotional aromatherapy kits, not the touch ones. Right. The emotional aromatherapy kit's nice because it's got the diffuser. Um, guys, I've got to go for school run. I'm really sorry. No, you're fine, Kathy. This is actually fine. You don't need to be here for this one. Kathy, <laughs> I'm going to give you a call in a minute on the way because I'm on the way as well. Right. I look forward to it. Right. In a while. Again. <laughs> yeah, I need you guys Hi, to let me know. Oh, Kathy. Yes. Kathy, I will. I'll reply to your email. Sorry. I can't even remember emailing you now. This is so long ago. I'll reply to it. Thanks. Um, bye. Bye, everybody. Bye, Kathy. Bye, Kathy. Bye, bye, Kathy. Bye. Okay, so Ems and Tim, if you bring the intro kits. Yeah. And then I'll bring. The family essential kits, so I'll bring 20, 30 of them. Yeah. And I'll bring 10 home essential kits. Yeah, okay. And six emotional aromatherapy kits. Okay. Is that and good? If we, if we need more by the weekend, you'll be able to get some more. Yeah. Won't you? Yeah, we need to, we'll have to tell them latest Wednesday. Okay. Some for the weekend, so they come Friday morning. Okay. Okay, great. All right. But the key thing is, is that we... Uh, the most nervous thing I am is that we do 
that we sell the kits and we put do not ship we don't put do not ship on it yeah i'm yeah. really if, nervous about people if, not doing that if karina or lena always put the kits through then it's only their responsibility and we just say look this is where you put it through over here is that that easy? would be my that would be my preference it just yeah. means karina and lena's time well yeah but i mean how many yeah but i mean well not gonna i don't think let's hope it does kind of time. Time. yeah i mean yeah Okay. Just Are 200 a day, guys. That's yeah, not okay. very mean. <laughs> okay. Are you happy to do that, Karina and Lena? Yeah, I cool. can do that. <laughs> and I Wonderful. just wanted to make a point. I know not everyone's here now, but um, so sometimes, so are we just thinking like what we're talking to people? It's cause not a, a few people do alternative therapies and things like that. But I think on this stall, uh, you know, we're, we're, we're just doTERRA. We're not focusing on yeah. it. I think so. I mean, it would be good if you had your own business cards that you can hand out. Yeah. Uh, we then need to talk about an after-show strategy. Is do we email all of them at once? Do we just send out the things? So we'll talk about that at a later date. Um, I think I think sampling, offering to sample them again, is really good way of like offering if there's anything they want to try. But yeah, afterwards, after the show. Okay. Um, well, at the show, we can kind of talk to each other how we want to do the after-the-show kind of stuff. Yeah, yeah, like we can send them samples, so then they've got the interest, they're hoping to receive something from us, and you know, uh, as well. Okay, you know. great. Is, there, is there any um, incentive for them to sign up on the day? So let's say a family central, central's kit, I don't know exactly how much that is, but 200 and yeah. something pounds. The Homo Census come from the motel. Well, no, so, the MOT, so we could say that's a show, we you could, know. We um, could say that's a show thing. Is that okay to it, say that? It's not though. Yeah, but it's not okay. It's not a show thing because they get they could get that anyway. Yeah, I know, but they're not going to know well, that, are they? they the, in, the incentive is that they get the class for free at the show. If they don't do that, they won't get the class for free. Okay, so it's a class we, we focus on as our, yeah. Okay. Yeah, so if they buy... If they buy an intro kit, a family essential kit, or a home essential kit, they get the £10 class for free, and they get the wild orange when they come to the class, or if, they do it, if they're doing a webinar, they get the wild orange on the day. Okay. Sorry, Lorna. Well, we said before, didn't we, Karina and uh, Lena were going to offer their own incentive, so... You can offer something if you like. If you think that's going to make a person sign up, you could get some A to Zs or uh, booklets. Or it is nice to have a, an un unfair offer that you're offering up there on that day. I think it is not. It is nice. We, to be honest with you, we've never really done that. Um, but I could see how that could benefit. I mean, obviously, the Immortel, I know, but they get that with the, with the Home Essentials, but the Physician's Kit, they don't really get very much more than the Physician's Kit. So maybe if we wanted to, that's a personal choice, you could offer something. You know. I think Lena and I have offered a Wild Orange with that, with the Family Essentials Kit at affairs when they've signed up then and there. Yeah, okay. And that's well. sometimes just swung it for a few people. Okay, yeah. Just have it. What about some, we get some key rings? The key yeah. rings could be good. Oh, I've got a couple. Yeah. Yeah. I've, got, I've got a couple, but I think they're a good incentive, yeah. The key thing is, though, what I would say the key thing is, is actually them signing up on the day isn't actually necessary. What you're looking for, the very best thing you're looking for is them to come to a class, because if you get them to the class, not only can you then buy them a kit, they can then get a kit, but you've then taught them an hour and a half of the oils. If they buy a kit on the day... They might not come. Mm. Well, it's, they met, some people do, but they've already bought a kit, so it's kind of irrelevant whether they bought the kit on the day or whether they buy the kit at the class. It doesn't matter. Mm. But if they come to the class, which is what we really want them to do, we're going to have taught them about doTERRA for an hour and a half. Yeah. Whereas that, on the show, they'll have only been taught for five minutes. That was one thing Kathy mentioned to me, actually. She was saying, could we do a small, like, mini class? If we've got several people around the school hanging around asking lots of questions, she was said, Kathy suggested that maybe a couple of times throughout the day, like, say, we could say, what, 11, 11.30 or 2.30 and 5.30, where you just do a quick run-through of some of the main oils. That's a great idea, if we've got space. And yeah, she, Kathy was saying, because then you're actually teaching them a little bit and whetting their appetite. It doesn't have to be long, but maybe a 15 minute, 20 minute discussion so that you can share with a couple of people at a time. But I, I think, 
I think that's a great idea. We just have to wait and I see. Think you have to, yeah, I think you have to read it on the day, don't you, with yeah, those sorts of people. And we don't want to... If there's room and space. Yeah, we don't want to annoy the organisers too much. There's always those people that say, oh, I, I can't come to that, I can't make that. You know, you could just say to them, well, come back at this time and we're going to do a little, little class. I think that's a great idea. And if they don't, if nobody comes, it doesn't matter. You just carry on with what you're doing anyway. So it doesn't, it's, you've not lost anything. Yeah, I think that's a good idea. But yes, the ideal is that people are booking in for the classes and paying there and then and booking in for their classes. Having said that, they don't always come to the class. So if they want to order a kit and then, you know, you... you, you well, they do to... generally if they pay yeah. for a class. Yeah, maybe. They do and they're going to get their wild orange when they come. They yeah. do generally come. I mean, it, it does bring in roundabouts. I mean, it, it, the ideal really is to get them to buy a home essential kit and come to a class on the day. Yeah. But... We really want them coming to that class, yeah. no, no matter what. Because that's okay. where we're really going to get them. Selling the Home Essential kit, to be honest with you, is a nice bit of volume. It doesn't make you much money, and it's not the thing that's going to be with the residual income. Okay. okay. You know, it makes it 20, 25 quid, doesn't well, it? So. If there's space to have a little mini class, you think that's my, that could be a good idea? Because yeah. I, think a, I think that's a great idea. I doubt there'll be space, though. Well, we'll have a look because you know, even like, even like when I talked to Mary about when she did the festivals, you know, she could have a look, you can walk around a little bit with the oils, with the with no, the, the, the organisers don't like that. You, they don't like that. This is Hampton Court, isn't it? This is a this is a yeah. No, I was going to say we have to be quite careful with that because they want you to stay within your stand. So okay. if you can get away with it discreetly, okay. I think we need to just have a look on Monday and see what we think. Okay. About yeah. that, it may be a bit tricky. I mean, I would. We could do it at the Love Natural Love Organic shows. You could do that because you could go to a corner in the corners and do that. We've not done it, and that's a good idea. Um, yeah, yeah. The, I've got the Om Yoga show in October booked, and I'm doing a class there for 45 yeah. minutes. Yeah. Yeah. That's, that's the lecture perfect. area. Yeah, perfect we're going to do for the do. festival the weekend. Yeah, okay. Yeah. We'll have a look when we get there, then. If there's, somewhere, if there's a little area or we think, you know, four or five people could stay here easily, then we'll just, we'll just do it. We'll try it. If no one turns up, it doesn't matter. You never know. Somebody might have like a little cafe. You could say to them, "Look, if I if we if I bring some people to your cafe and we pay for drinks for them, you know, or, or like a tea or something, so they can join the class, are you, are you happy for us to use this area to do a little talk through something like that? I mean, we can see." Yeah, I think we try it. We try it one day, and if, if it doesn't work, we leave it. And if everyone turns up, and it's it doesn't really it doesn't really matter, does it? No. Yeah. We'll just give it a go. Yeah. All right. And for those of you that for those of you that missed, it, they start. It starts at. Uh, no, you need to be there between nine and nine thirty every day. Um, Monday finishes between ten and eleven thirty. <coughs> uh, most other days it it closes at seven thirty, and Sunday it closes at half five. And if those that are doing Sunday, wouldn't mind helping Karina to pack up the stand at the end of the day that'd be wonderful yeah i think that's just mainly moira and my sister nadia well like tim's around so he boys. might be you haven't got the car but i could bring the boys yeah. so just pack it up but... daniel did daniel I think did you have any okay. questions i think we would have sold everything um, by then. <laughs> no, i'm gonna i'm gonna cycle in for my mum's because uh, it will be a nightmare where is she daniel where is she where does she live uh sunbury oh so it's very not... nice yeah, right on the river, mate. It's lovely. Yeah, I know it well. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so, yeah, perfect. Brilliant. Awesome, guys. Well done, Karina and Lena. Awesome, guys. Yeah, I'm looking forward yeah, to it. Thank you so that. much. Yeah, I'm looking. I'm looking forward to it. I think it's going to be a bit nuts, <laughs> especially, <laughs> yeah. especially um, uh, the public days are just so busy. Once people come through, it'll be it'll be interesting <laughs> to see how it works. Uh, Daniel, Karina sent you a link to sign up to. You need to use that link, not the one I sent you. Perfect. Thank right. you. Yeah. It should um, it should have your name at the top of the email and says please oh, click on this you. link. Yeah. Cool. Just one thing, Wonderful, just, thank you. Just from doing the fairs, you know, one thing is when they get busy, you end up like, where's the list for this? Where's the oils? Where's my, where's my wild orange? Where's the computer? You kind of, and it gets a bit, you can start losing stuff. 
So remember to try and remember where everything is. And if you've got a list of all the classes somewhere that doesn't move, so stays in the same place. Mm. People yeah. always refer people, maybe have a couple somewhere that don't that stuck down somewhere. Yeah, stick it to it. Just on a piece of paper it gets lost and then no one knows what's uh, yeah. refer it to. Yeah. I might get another clipboard. <laughs> yeah. Hi guys, hi guys, it's Robin here. Can I just ask a quick question? Because I need to run into school. You guys have been at work with me and walked home and drove. <laughs> <home. laughs> <laughs> um, I know. I'm, it's on safe driving mode because I'm in my car. It won't let me use my video. Um, but a question about the incentives on the day. Maybe we can sort out in the WhatsApp group what everyone's doing because I think it's really going to be important that we all have the same thing going on because otherwise people might see that other people who've gone to the stall get something different. I think it, it runs the risk of making us look unprofessional. If someone's offering a keychain and someone's offering a wild orange. Yeah, I agree. Yeah. We just all sort of chat on WhatsApp on what day we are, or even between the days, because if a neighbor comes and says, oh, says to their neighbor, oh, go check out the doTERRA stall, and I got this lovely wild orange, and then they go, yeah. and that's, do you know what I mean? I think maybe we should decide what we're gonna do, otherwise I think it, it could be awkward. Yeah. I agree. I agree. And then if people and don't want to, time, like we need to have time to buy what we're going to be offering for next week, right? Yeah, yeah. Ag agreed. So if people want to put on the WhatsApp group what they're thinking of doing, and then if people want to do that, they can. Some people may. I personally probably won't do that, but I'm fine with other people doing that. Is that make, is that okay? Yeah. Yeah, that's fine. All right. Um, All right. Well, thanks, guys. I gotta run. See you, Robin. Bye. Bye. Cool. Well, we'll discuss further on the WhatsApp. Okay. Yeah. All right. Good job, Dorian. Okay. Brilliant. Uh -huh. Okay. Yeah, question, Lorna. <laughs> Lorna looked like she's about to ask something. <laughs> no, no. Sorry, I was <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> Tim wants to meet you, Lorna. Lorna, hi. Hi, Tim. Hi. How are you? Yeah, I'm good. Nice to meet you finally. Yeah, <laughs> lovely. Lovely. We should have a chat at some point. Yeah. Well, soon, but it's actually... when you're around, okay. and you can meet Graham as well. Yeah, lovely. That'd be awesome. Yeah, brilliant. Is this going to be your first proper experience with DoTerra, Lorna? Uh, yes, so I'm going to have to do a bit of revising, aren't I, over the next uh, few days? Thrown in at the deep end, like You'll it. You'll be fine. You'll be You'll fine. Be yeah, I I'm love sampling it. Sampling everyone, going, oh, test me, test me. <laughs> <laughs> you know, if you get stuck at all, just say, I'll, you know, go and ask one of us or or yeah. whoever's there. It doesn't matter to to say to somebody, oh, I'll find out for you. That's a good question. Yeah. Yeah. You know, we'll have the books there as well. Yeah. Stuff up with people and. Lord, if you stand there and do it, you can definitely do it. Because I, <laughs> I'm not very good on the all, so you'll be fine. What? Are you better than me, Tim? <laughs> what, what day do you go in, Lorna? Uh, Tuesday. Tuesday, okay. What you Sounds got like try, a good day. What you've got to try and do is you've got to try and beat Daniel, okay? Because <laughs> Daniel, I'm not, I don't want him to toot his horn too much, but... It's about time first, you did. <laughs> he did his first show, what, a month and a half ago? And with literally within ten minutes of being there, he'd sold our home essential kit. Oh my god! <laughs> wow, that's brilliant, amazing. So he sacked off the rest of the day and had a nap. Yeah, I did. I went off. He did. No, he didn't. No, he didn't. Go home. Yeah. No, I peaked. Didn't. I peaked too soon. I think that was my problem. <laughs> right. Do the school run. See you later. Bye, Dan. Yeah. See you later, Tim. Bye, Tim. <laughs> oh, so God, so so yeah. Emily, you're getting the Izetta, are you? Is that what yeah, we'll, get, we'll get on and have a look at that. Okay, and yeah, you're getting to... wild oranges, Ems, and intro yeah. kits. Yeah. And That's I'm getting fun. family essentials, home essentials, and emotions. And uh, with, with regarding to the incentive, you don't think we should just get like 50 key rings? Yeah. Well, if that's what we want to do, I, and then I you... do think they're a good incentive, personally. Happy to happy to do that. We just need to work out because they don't cost any. They're no. They're not PV, are they? No. So how do we how do we work out how how that gets paid back to us to somebody? Okay. Yeah, because obviously it needs to be covered by everybody, doesn't it? Really, that if they want to do it. So I guess that would come back down to me and Lena if we're taking down the um, if we're signing the people up on the computer and putting do not ship. We're, and we're writing down who sells the kit. And you the won't, if, you, 
what you'll have to do is you'll only have to do the kit. You won't be able to, because if you're giving it as an incentive, yeah. you can't put the key ring through. The computer. No, it has to be separate. That has and I guess that's our own cost, isn't it? It's not, yeah. it's, it's mine cost. or Emily's or Elena's or, yeah. That's a cost. I think that that's something that we need to decide on the WhatsApp then. If yeah. people are happy with it and then people need to maybe bring cash to cover. Somebody needs to order them all and then bring cash to put in the cash box. Yeah. To cover so many key rings. They'll use them. Anyway. Yeah, so if they sell a key ring, then they need to be... Well, I would say rather than put cash in the cash box, whoever sells Home Essential or Physician Kit and they give a key ring to somebody, they need to put six quid, you know, so if they, if they do, they sell five of those, they need to give 36 quid back to the pot. Yeah. Yeah. Because they'll get that money in the fast start paid to them. Yeah. Yeah. Mm. So we just need to. I'll see you guys later. I'm going to get Joshua as well. So see have you, a Daniel. lovely day, guys. Thanks, Daniel. Bye. 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 Bye, -bye. <laughs> but to be fair, I would almost say that's almost more hassle than it's worth. But the key know. rings, sorry. Yeah, yeah it's, it is hassle. Yeah. But let's think about it and see, and then talk on the WhatsApp group and see if we want to do yeah. that. Yeah. Okay. Some days, some days may be a bit quieter than others, and it might be less hassle. <laughs> we might be oh. saying, oh, you know, we're, we're ten down. We've we've already got fifty oh, enrolments so today. <laughs> No, the day we want an extra ten the next day. <laughs> it's the afterwards. It's the marking yeah. off who who sold what and did they give a key ring with it, and then getting them to pay the thirty six quid. Well, afterwards. Yeah, we just say to people they need to get their own. Then we would suggest that we all do the same thing, so it yep. is yep. you know, and everybody Agre get themselves like ten key rings. Agreed. I think that's a great idea. Yeah. Okay. All right. Cool. Let's put it, I've got to go too. So let's yeah. we create a WhatsApp and we put that on the WhatsApp. Perfect. Okay. Thank you. Thanks, Karina. Thanks, Lena. See you, everybody. See you later. Bye, guys. Thank you. Well done. Bye. Thanks, Emily. Well Bye. done, Karina. Well done, Karina. Awesome. Yeah. Well done, Karina. <laughs> it's not exactly mammoth at times. But you know. It's not. It's not. It's not easy what you're doing. No, yeah, but I think what? start at the top. Start as you mean to go on. You know. Absolutely. No, exactly. You won't go to Lithuania. They'll be, they'll be easy. Yeah, <laughs> and, and the great thing is, next year, Lena, uh, Karina, yeah. is that this will be your show. You, you know, maybe, hopefully, next year you'll be able to just open, yeah. give, it, yeah. give the spots to just your team. Yeah. Sorry, Lena's just dropping off her daughter. Yeah, bring her here. <laughs> you know, next year it will be, be. It will be next year. Yeah, it'll be. So, and fun. then you'll have the whole of Hampton Court all under you. <laughs> <laughs> hopefully. Oh, it's a bit right, nuts, isn't it? Thanks, Nathan. Thank See you. you. Later. Okay, do then. I, do I need to send this recording anywhere? Yeah, to, you need to send this to Debbie Walker and Tara Whittle. Okay, cool. Tara, what day is Tara doing? Saturday. Oh, okay. Yeah. So if I send you the link to the new thing, if you can send that to everyone, Karina, is that all right? Yeah, okay. Yeah, that's fine. Thank I don't you. think I have everyone's email that's coming. Yeah, I've got their emails from registering them. Okay, cool. All right, wonderful. Yeah. See you later, guys. All right, have a good day. Are you, is that, are you okay, Lorna? Are you all right with? Yeah, I think so. Yeah, that's fine. Yeah, I think to be honest, you know, I'll just. Come